was a little girl, even smaller than you, I would go to work with my mom. She had the coolest job ever. She was a kindergarten teacher. She got to talk to and teach and have fun with kids all day long. I would play in my mom's classroom and pretend that I was the teacher. I fell in love with the colorful posters, the crayons that they got to color everything with, fun songs they got to sing, and playtime each afternoon. All the kids loved her and looked up to her. They would always run up to her yelling, Mrs. Fox, and give her a giant hug. I knew that I was going to be a teacher just like my mom someday. Then I grew up a little bit and I still wanted to be a teacher. So one day, I went to a teacher store and bought a bunch of awesome supplies so that I could play school at home. I bought posters and pencils and markers and grade books and name tags and games and a chalkboard. My mom gave me some of her old school stuff too. I was in heaven. After a few more years, when the imaginary kids weren't as fun anymore, I helped out in an elementary school classroom when I was a senior in high school. These kids were awesome. They talked to me and asked me questions. I got to hear all about their likes and interests, and I got to know what amazing people they were. I got to teach lessons to them and see how excited they were when they got a question right. I shared in their joy because I was so happy to see them learning and having fun in school. By that point, there was no turning back. My passion was in teaching elementary school kids. There was no other option. It is what I love to do. So, I went to Indiana University and studied elementary education. After four long years, I packed up my degree, my excitement, and my 64 pack of Crayola crayons, and I got a job here, and I've been living my dream ever since. I am so excited to get to know all of you better. We are going to have a fantastic year.